ਆਸਟ੍ਰੇਲੀਆ ਦੇ ਸ਼ਹਿਰ ਬ੍ਰਿਸਬੇਨ ਦੇ ਗੁਰੂ ਘਰ ਗੁਰਦੁਆਰਾ ਇਨਾਲਾ ਚ ਵਿਸਾਖੀ ਦੇ ਤਿਉਹਾਰ ਤੇ ਕੀਰਤਨ ਅਤੇ ਸ਼ਬਦ ਗਾਇਨ ਕੀਤੇ ਗਏ ਇਸ ਸਮੇਂ ਗੁਰੂ ਘਰ ਦੇ ਪ੍ਰਬੰਧਕਾਂ ਨੇ ਸੰਗਤਾਂ ਨੂੰ ਸੰਬੋਧਨ ਕੀਤਾ ਕੁਇਨਸਲੈਂਡ ਦੇ ਸੈਨੇਟਰ ਪੌਲ ਮਾਰਟਿਨ ਸਕਾਰ ਨੇ ਗੁਰੂ ਘਰ ਨਤਮਸਤਕ ਹੁੰਦਿਆਂ ਪੰਜਾਬੀ ਸਿੱਖਾਂ ਦੀ ਤਾਰੀਫ ਕਰਦਿਆਂ ਕਿਹਾ ਕਿ ਸਿੱਖ ਕਮਿਊਨਿਟੀ ਦਾ ਆਸਟ੍ਰੇਲੀਆ ਦੇ ਕਾਰਜਾਂ ਵਿੱਚ ਬੜਮੁੱਲਾ ਯੋਗਦਾਨ ਹੈ ਉਹਨਾਂ ਕਿਹਾ ਕਿ ਮੈਂ ਕੈਨਬਰਾ ਪਾਰਲੀਮੈਂਟ ਵਿੱਚ ਵੀ ਤੁਹਾਡੇ ਦਿੱਤੇ ਯੋਗਦਾਨ ਬਾਰੇ ਬੋਲਿਆ ਹੈ at the outset let me also note that this is a very important week for the Sikh community the Basaki uh, event the Sikh New Year which has great significance in the community so uh, i wish you all the best during this important time for your community i have previously spoken in the Australian Senate about the contribution which the Australian Sikh community makes to our country and i think australia is absolutely blessed that so many of you here today chose to make australia your home there is so much in your faith and in your values which reflects what it is to be an australian the belief that every person is equal regardless of their race their ethnic background their wealth whatever it is we are all equal this is absolutely fundamental to our australian values also your belief in freedom of religion that everyone in our community should be free senator ne kya hai ke jadon to covid pandemic shuru hoya hai udo to hi guru kara ate punjabi community needy lokan nu free langar barta rahi hai is the community spirit and the spirit of giving that the seek Australian community demonstrates on many occasions. I spoke about this in the Senate last year in relation to the COVID crisis and how the Sikh community reached out to so many people in our community. It didn't matter what race they they were, what background they had, from international students to our first Australians, the Australian Sikh community provided support and cared for the members of our community. From my perspective as an Australian senator, it makes me honored to be your representative in our australian parliament ona kaha ki assi jande ha ki tade rishtedar dost mitr covid di situation kan india ne ate assi tadi puri madad karange senator ne kiya hai ki oh yakini bana rahe ne ki pradhan mantri scott morrison nal gal baat kar rahe ne ate gal baat kar vi chuke ne is masle da chheti hal hovega say something about the farmers protests First, can I thank all of the members of the Australian Sikh community who raised their concerns with me in relation to this important issue. I understand the great links there are between the Australian Sikh community and your relatives, uh your friends back home in India. I understand how concerned the Australian Sikh community is. with the laws which were passed and the impact that will have on your relatives and your friends earlier today i spent about an hour i think talking to elders of the community who gave me some more examples of how these laws will impact the community on the ground in india can i please give you this assurance i have communicated the concerns of the community to our prime minister scott morrison he understands the concerns and he understands the issues i've also una part vich kisana de masle te gal baat karde ha kiha ke peaceful protest di oh hamesha himayat vich ne una kiha ke oh lagatar australia sikh community de kite kamma bare scott morrison nu jaanu karwande rehnde ne with him concerns raised with me in the community in relation to uh the right i believe in for all people wherever they live in the world to engage in peaceful protest without persecution so these issues have also been raised with our prime minister he is aware of the situation and he is aware of the concerns in the australian sikh community and indeed in the broader community i will continue to pass these messages 
and concerns through to our Prime Minister. So please, I say to everyone here, if you have additional concerns, if there are things which you are hearing that are happening in India, the Australian Government would like to know those concerns and I will pass them on to our Prime Minister. लास्ट ਵਿੱਚ ਉਹਨਾਂ ਕਿਹਾ ਕਿ ਜੇਕਰ ਤੁਹਾਡਾ ਕੋਈ ਵੀ ਮਸਲਾ ਜਾਂ ਇੰਡੀਆ ਚ ਹੋ ਰਹੇ ਕਿਸਾਨਾਂ ਦੇ ਪ੍ਰੋਟੈਸਟ ਬਾਰੇ ਗੱਲ ਕਰਨਾ ਚਾਹੁੰਦੇ ਹੋ ਤਾਂ ਮੇਰੇ ਨਾਲ ਖੁੱਲ ਕੇ ਗੱਲ ਕਰੋ ਮੈਂ ਤੁਹਾਡੀ ਆਵਾਜ਼ ਨੂੰ ਬੁਲੰਦ ਕਰਾਂਗਾ The last point I would like to make to you is I heard some disturbing reports today when I was speaking to some of your elders and members of the management committee about Australians of Sikh heritage potentially being persecuted because you are giving voice to your democratic right to express your concerns in relation to the farmer laws in India can i please say to each and every one of you if you ever come across such persecution or attempted discrimination against you in our country in relation to these matters please contact me I will immediately raise them at the highest levels. It is unacceptable. No one in our beautiful country should be persecuted because of their faith or because they are expressing their democratic views in relation to any matter. That is your right as an Australian. That is your right as an Australian. So if you ever feel as if someone is attempting to apply pressure on you to discriminate against you to harass you because of a democratic belief you have please please raise this concern with me and I will raise it at the highest level of our government because it is unacceptable and I have asked uh, your elders members of the management committee to give me further details with respect to some of the examples which they brought to my attention Lastly again can I tell you when I speak to people uh, who have come to our beautiful country for, from other places and they tell me about the opportunities they've found in our country after coming here I always think of this uh, that not only not only did you find a home in Australia but Australia was so fortunate to find you Australia also found you because you contribute so much to our beautiful country in terms of taking advantage of the opportunities that Australia has to build a family a business to make a life for yourself and also you bring with you an appreciation of the freedoms and the importance of the institutions that we have in this country because in many cases you come from places where they don't have those freedoms and those institutions are not as strong so each and every one of you is an absolute blessing to our beautiful country so with that thank you so much for the invitation to speak with you today and please i am a dear friend of the community and if there are any issues in the nature of which i've discussed uh, today please raise them with me and you will have my 100% support thank you